Hello and welcome back to Silent Hill Downpour. We last left very grumpy Mr. Murphy, or better known as Alan Wake's uglier brother, and we left him in the middle of the city. By that I mean, of course, in some weird foggy place. And I reckon I need to get across this bridge. That would be my reckoning. And now the bridge is up, I need to find some way of getting into probably the control building, would be my guess. Oh. Luckily, there appears to be a door. Up you go, Murph. See, I like Murphy, right? He just does what he's told, gets on ladders. <gasps> what was this? What's that? What's that? Harmony, second part. Harmony? Always I wanna be with. No, probably not that kind of harmony. By the way, just in case I suddenly pass out and die, I'm playing this in a room without the window open because it makes a lot of noise, because the house is old and the door rattles. It's also very hot because for some reason we suddenly, the seasons decided we actually do have a summer after all. So that's the reason if I just suddenly go, Ugh, clunk. Good stuff. The only thing I think is a real shame, um, this game doesn't have a lot in the way of music, which is a bit odd. Because think about to Silent Hill 3, you got that sort of industrial kind of well, kind of like that, but, you know. On a side note, I was hoping that would be a party bridge. Just saying. Anyway, point being, you have a lot of sort of like, boom, clash, bang, clash, boom, as you're like running around. It's really freaky. Big rig. Alright. Need a boat. I'm guessing heading left towards the sort of pier kind of area would be the way to go. I swear to god, if they make another Silent Hill game where the protagonist walks and runs as slowly as Murphy does, I'm going to have to cut off his toes. Ooh! Hello! Yeah, you're twitching at me! Yeah, you're good at that! You're good, like King Twitch! Ugh, guess what? Get a fire axe! I'm protecting you! This is for the town's benefit! You may start to fire with your horrible, ugly face. That's how fire start, by the way, with horrible, ugly faces. Port District. Do I want to go down there, to the port district? Looks kind of crappy. Mm, I don't think I do, I think I want to follow it around to the boat, which is probably in this sort of direction, towards the sea. Oh, a boat! Speak of the devil. Is this the boat, or just a boat? Out of... I think it's... Ah, probably just a boat. So there's two boats! DJ Ricks! You could have picked. Although... Not that I'm claiming that all convicts, are, you know, would do this. I mean, Murphy, being a convict, could probably, you know, just hop by the boat, right? I need a key. Do I have a key for this? Boat key. Ooh! Neat. For those wondering why I'm not doing the side quests, um... I don't normally do side quests in video games unless I kind of have to, I suppose. I don't find them particularly interesting. Even one of my favourite games, Nier, most of the side quests are very dull. I may come back and do the side quests. Uh, I don't know. It, it depends. It depends. Nothing. Nothing. If I get to, like, sort of molest some angry monsters, and they're like, please, please do not molest me, for I am a resident of Silent Hill, and I just go, Mwah! grope. Then maybe. Maybe I will. It's very serene, I think. Oh. No, no, no. You weren't on the boat, lady. Gotta be kidding me. Yeah, you do. You, you, she was clearly not Did on the boat. Did you really think it could end like this? After everything you saw back there, everything we've been through, yeah, you what think did going happen? back to prison is all that's at stake here? We're not going to Wayside. We're not? What are you saying? Huh. Turn the boat around. Are you out of your mind? We're free! Free! When we reach the opposite shore, I'll go one way, you can go the other. It's that easy. We've got unfinished business, you and I. Do we? I have no idea what the hell you're talking about. And Thank honestly, you. Honestly, I don't care anymore. Uh, and that. There is no way in hell I'm going back. It wasn't a request. How rude. We've both just been through hell. Haven't you been paying attention? No, you haven't been paying attention. I haven't. You think this is all an accident? Just a yes. big coincidence? Yes. We crashed. This town, it knows me. It showed me things. Nah, the town's didn't do that. Wants me to finish this. Unless it's Swindon. Don't you understand? It'll Swindon never does let that. us go until we finish what we started. Swindon's what basically you something. started. I told you. I'm not going back. That is some bad trigger discipline. 
You don't have your finger on the trigger unless you're meaning to fire. Which you're pro clearly not. Fine. Oh. My goodness, that's a big dildo. Oh, it's a baton. Sorry. How's it going, Murph? You know, thinking about murder. Be leaving us soon. What do you want, Sewell? You weren't thinking of leaving before you paid back my favor, were you? Napier. <laughs> what am I talking about? Of course you're gonna keep your end of the deal. You're a real stand-up guy, Murphy. Parole report says so right there in black and white. A model prisoner, right? Sure would be awful if they found out about what you did to that child bugger and bastard, though, wouldn't it? I mean, shit. That would ruin everything, wouldn't it? What do you want me to do? What you're good at, of course. Ridding the world of Scowling. monsters. I got another one for you. Who is it? Don't worry yourself about the details, Cupcake. Just take out the garbage like you did before and we'll be square. When? There's gonna be a little... disturbance tonight. The other guards and me are gonna have our hands full, so no one's gonna notice when you head down to the showers and find your guy waiting there, just like last time. And then? Oh, I think you know what comes next. Unless, of course, you're thinking of breaking our deal. And this other guy, he deserves it? Oh, Murph, you have no idea how bad he deserves it. Hell, I only wish I could do it myself. So, what do you say, Cupcake? You gonna play ball? Oh, um, are we? Oh, no, I didn't. I'll take care of it. Good job, Murphy. Well done. They're not very subtle, is it? He's gonna get me copyright striked. Thank you, Sewell, you jerk. Man, what a dick. I know, right? Oh, hello, Halloween number two. I know. <laughs> you just sit here just looking at this asshole, right? Yeah, yeah, seriously. seriously. Like, how do you think he gets a job as a prison guard after, like, trying to advocate murdering people? I don't know. That, that's pretty bizarre. Oh, that's what I thought. God, I, th I thought I was going mad. <laughs> yeah, as if. I know. <laughs> oh my god, I have hands! Hey! Welcome home. Thank you. You know what we're doing. It doesn't matter what you want. We allow ourselves to see them. Um, Lazen, that was weird. Appreciate that though. I wouldn't have felt welcomed otherwise. Yep, no, Murphy. Except for the bloody door. Escape the prison. Hey, I think I've seen this film once, right? We're in, we're in the prison, then I have to escape from LA, and then I have to shoot a load of people, and everyone's like, I thought you were dead, or I thought you were shorter. And, yeah, it's weird. Wait, where's my shit? Oh, for crying out loud. Someone's gonna skanked all my hard-earned skanked goods from the things I skanked. Ugh. Um... Attention all inmates. No talking during movement. Walk in a single line. Stop at the end of each hall. Sounds reasonable enough. There's not many guards in this prison. Just saying. Uh, <laughs> hang on! The lock is like, separately animated. It just sits there in the middle. What the hell? Lazy bastards. Alright, let's go see what we can molest. Oh, can we just leave? No, of course the not. The door must be open from somewhere else. Yes, thank you, Murphy. I imagine it's from the central control building where all the things are around. If I was to hazard a guess. Right, so, can't go down any further. Hell of a prison, though, Murph. You have found yourself in. I don't even have my lighter. Well, they just took all my stuff. I needed that to live. Probably. Oh no, my health kit. I definitely needed that to live. I collected loads. So I can open up my own pharmacy business. Alright, well, I guess we move onwards. Bless you. Whatever. 
Oh god, not an iron girder. My worst fear. Right next to wasps. I might be able to cross over on this. Oh. Push A to push. This could easily have been done in the cutscene without me mashing the button. Did I ever tell you lot how much I hate quick time events? I I probably did, to be fair. Oh, I'm gonna have to balance the entire way, aren't I? Oh yes, of course I am. Are we gonna have an earthquake as we go over and most of go. Ah! Ah! Oh, I'm having flashbacks. Wait, but your prism is actually a bottomless pit? I'm impressed. Man, America has its shit really, like, down when it's prisons. I mean, over here we just have, like, buildings with, like, cells, but over there you've got, like, bottomless pits and, like, evil Satan monsters. I'm really impressed. I think England needs to step it up in terms of, you know, sort of the evil thing. For God's sake, Murphy, you cross a beam like my nan. Right, this beam is super wide. Unless you're pissed, there's no reason you need to balance like this, okay? Come on, Murphy. Hold it together, man. Oh, maybe he's scared of heights. Uh oh. This has horrible flashbacks, that really irritating bit in Silent Hill 4 we have to rotate the central structure. Although, that was kind of creepy. Ooh, a weapon! That probably means we're about to get attacked by something. If I was so cynical, you might say. I've not collected any items. Well, I did have some items. I need another key card. Yeah, I'm working on it, Mev. That might come in handy. But how do I get the damn thing open? With. It's a bit dark. Oh dear. Um. Which, which one's the new one? The psychological report. So and so is a male, years old, he is serving year sentence, blah blah blah. He appears to be in excellent physical health. Um, yeah, he's so, yeah, that's good. Insert code. Ugh. I literally can't see a thing. Is there a down here? That's slightly sinister. Sorry, I'm just adjusting my volume. Givey, gimme. You don't need these anymore, do you? Access card. Cool beans. How did he get hold of them? And who is he? Aha! This is probably for the code. At the door. Wait, I don't have mine? How rude. Let's get this crap off. <coughs> Murph, get the rest of the wood. <coughs> Murph, just aim for the wood. <coughs> Alright, fine. Alright, let's have a look at this code then. What we got here? So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 has numbers 1 to 8 on there. So, 5 inmates, 5 codes. No, no Murph, don't throw the axe. Murph, zoom in. So, we got 1, 2, 4, 3. How do we know which one's in order, though? Hmm. Okay, that makes it a bit more difficult. But we got a two, a one, a one. A one, three, one, two, four. No. Nah. If you had a one, two, three, four, and a five in each one, that could help sort of narrow this down, perhaps. Right, he's got a five. He's got a four. He's got a three. He's got a six. Hmm. I think I may want that, so... Hmm, I think I'm gonna go work this out, would be the safest bet. I'm just trying to think how. There's gotta be a clue here. Right! I'm gonna stop this for a second while I work this out. Hmm. Well, I say stop this, I'm going to leave it recording while I work out and then edit it out afterwards because it's a far less hassle.